Okay. Right. Indeed. Um, so I think what you're suggesting is we're at a potential inflection point for Absolutely. desktop Linux. Absolutely. Like the, the, t t the technology to do this is mature enough that right. we can uh, shift the paradigm of desktop Linux away from uh, packages that uh, uh, have root and can yes. spray files anywhere yes. over the yes. operating system to an immutable atomic yep. future. And I get people people hate that. They're like, I've I've mounted my Asamba share and slash made up name for years. Right. Now I can't write to it. You know, this is off. like you're going to have to change that paradigm, right? Like you're going to have to think about it in a different way. Um, and that could be hard for people. And yeah. I totally understand that it will be hard. However, all the stuff I'm going to show you here, you can use on your normal distro, right? And then you could just start to think about, start to think about the problem. So as right. these things get sorted out, you know, you'll have people used to log in as in as root in X, right? Like you would type mm -hmm. root and then you would go in. And then as soon as people started coming out with things like sudo and don't log in, people would lose their mind. They're like, you know, if if you log in as root and you break your computer, it's your own fault for not knowing, for not yeah. reading the document, you know. But hey, every I like I like seatbelts. You yeah. know what I mean? Like, <laughs> uh, like so we make a compliance tool, right? Like if I told you, hey, everyone at work, stop making unencrypted S3 buckets. Within 15 minutes, someone's going to accidentally make one, right? So right. we make a tool that doesn't let you make unencrypted S3 buckets and a bunch of other stuff, and it applies policy. They're guardrails. Right. You want those things. In the past, you used to hit, be able to hit Control Alt Backspace, and it would kill your graphical desktop. Right. And now we look back now, we're like, that is the great. Why would you do that, right? Mm -hmm. But back then, same arguments. Well, it's never worked. As, you know, they're taking away my freedom. You know, it's never worked that way. If someone is too stupid to hit Control Alt Backspace, then you know yeah. go buy a mac idiot you know like <laughs> like we, we we had all these ways of like you know like we have our set ways this is how the linux desktop is and if people don't believe in this debian distro kind of boil the ocean mentality then you're doing it wrong right <laughs> um and then chromebooks came out and said you know what we don't care how linux distros are built and in the entire episode that we've been doing so far i bet you more chromebooks have been sold than any linux distro has been downloaded in the past few minutes, right. right? We know Linux as an operating system is capable of making these reliable systems. All we gotta do is get there. Yeah. And people are figuring it out and we wanna help them. And that's why I'm making this. That's why, that's why I'm doing this, right?